All right, this morning we got a number of good stocks on both the buy and the sell list. So first one is going to be General Mills. Uh, 4.19 mean the current means the current conversation is 4.19 standard deviations more positive than normal with a high relative volume. Let's see what's going on. So this has happened 19 times. It's been higher 57% of the time by an average of negative 0.213%. Earnings, price target lower, and macro outlook. Medtronic insulin pumps, 18 times, 50% of the time is higher by an average of negative 0.49. Earnings, technical price action, and dividends. Let's look at a, at least one more here. ATNM, 3.35%, 50% of the time is higher. It's happened 28 times over last year where the sentiment has been this high. M&A activity, drug trial, and then downgrade here. And then let's look at United Airlines, 1.96 positive. I mean, it's lower right now. Not necessarily a good opportunity. All right, the Home Depot, negative uh, 4.17. The current conversation is more negative than 99% of prior conversations over the last month. Dividends, earnings, and macro. All right, this happened eight times over the last year, negative 0.35, and it's a 50-50 shot. Dividends, earnings, and, and macroeconomic. Merck. Merck. Okay. Five times. So it hasn't happened a whole lot. 60% of the time it's lower. That's only three out of five, negative 1.07, technical price action, option activity, and dividends. JD.com, eight times, negative 0.25 of 50-50. Short squeeze, upgrade, technical price action. All right, let's see what's happening on the short squeeze list. If there's anything new, AMC, GameStop, Amazon, BBBY, Tesla, NVIDIA, Wish, this is a new one. Um, advanced micro devices and beyond meat. Those are new ones today. All right. Thank you. Have a good day.